are coming together for South Dakota's first state veterans cemetery that will give veterans the option to be buried on the eastern side of South Dakota. Back in October, the city of Sioux Falls donated more than 60 acres of land on the northeast side of town for this cemetery. KDLT's Miranda Page has an update on where organizers are with the project. It may look empty now, but Aaron Pollard, Deputy Secretary of Veterans Affairs, looks forward to the future of this land. Every time I come out here, I'm kind of I'm kind of taken aback by how peaceful it is out here. The wind kind of always gently blows out here, and I think when you walk on the property, you can just tell that this was kind of meant to be a place of significance and a place to remember and a place to honor. This plot of land will be transformed into South Dakota's first state cemetery. Designs are 95% complete and construction could begin as early as this fall. The cemetery will be constructed with locally sourced materials such as Sioux Quartzite. We're making sure that we get it right and we're, we're making sure that the cemetery, will, while it'll be a national, it'll be maintained to national cemetery standards, it'll be a uniquely South Dakota Veterans Cemetery. This design is getting veterans like Ken Tunison excited. This is awesome because for over 20 years, the veterans have been trying to get an East River Veterans Cemetery. The cemetery will offer plots in 12 different phases, each taking 10 to 15 years to fill. The light blue towards the bottom is the first stage which will take up about 10 to 12 acres and include around 2,300 grave sites. A huge flag will be flown on top of this hill, which will be seen for miles, and many of these trees will be preserved. The main focus of the cemetery will be the committal shelter. It'll be the a, sh a brief service and then the military funeral honors that would take place. By the time it's all completed, we'll have a brand new gathering place that's significant to where veterans and non-veterans together can come and we can be together and just, just celebrate the sacrifices and celebrate the service. In Sioux Falls, Miranda Page, KDLT News. Once construction begins, organizers plan on it taking about 12 to 18 months to complete. With 120 to 150 years, the cemetery will hold around 28,000 grave sites for veterans and family members.